in North Carolina and I'm in a very, very exciting place and I am so excited to tell you, right over here, there's someone's house who I've come to visit and play with today. Let's go see who it is. Tour of your house. Oh, yes. Okay. Go. Okay, so here is the living room with my cabinet of curiosities. I love this. <laughs> All thrifted. <laughs> thrifted, thrifted wonders. Yeah, lamps, thrifted couch. Everything's thrifted. When Beth walked in, I was like, this is all thrifted. I know. And these are from an RV. An RV, and they rock and swivel. That's so awesome. And I then love. this cute table. Look at this really amazing mirror. This is crazy. Also thrifted. Okay. Crazy. Um, we've got a couple cute little bedrooms. With some art. And... Let's get a little view of the... master and then I love this mirror over here too oh, yeah. very cute all the mirrors everywhere yes we need our mirrors <laughs> yes I have so many <laughs> I do too <laughs> and I have now I have some from the shop <laughs> oh yeah you've like, collected a bunch keeping all these here's our kitchen a little coffee area. I think this is like, I mean, I love all of it, but I just want to like sit with you and have coffee in this chair That's in front best. of the fireplace. And I love that you did, this is a rug, I'm assuming, yeah. right? Yeah. Such a great idea. A, a sale. It's like a sheepskin. I love that. It's really soft. And look how cute her little dining room. Yeah, that is doubling as an office. For <gasps> and this is where the, the magic of the sifted, do you call it the signature collection? Yeah. Yeah. Happen, which it's kind of gonna shift soon. So I, I'm gonna get all the secrets yeah, today. I can't wait. Let me introduce you. Hello to Liv. <laughs> if you don't know who Liv is, she has sifted clothing. She is currently shutting down yes. her vintage store. <laughs> Pull the plug. Pull the plug on the vintage <laughs> store. But she has an amazing signature collection and so many fun things to come. So you definitely have to go check out Liv. But I'm gonna turn the camera on her and ask yes. her a few little questions. A little interview. All right, so where are we first of all? So we're in Winston-Salem, North Carolina. This is your hometown. Yes, my hometown. My family lives here. We're going to go pick up Anna Margaret, Margot who, Rolfe. Yes, who is also a YouTuber, so you guys yes. can check her out. And you are taking me where? So we're going to go, I think I, ha I have three spots in mind for sure. Definitely a Goodwill. The one that I want to go to has accessories, so it's got this whole wall of jewelry bangles, earrings, pins. Ooh. When I think of Beth, I definitely think of accessories. Yes, and I feel like I need some new ones. And like, I literally always find such on-trend yes. things there. Like I have this yes. necklace on, it's I a love that. right now, but I got it at Goodwill. Um, we'll go there, and then there's a place downtown called Design Archives, where it's like little booths of vintage clothing that people have already kind of curated, so I want to take Beth there highlight some uh, Winston vintage. Yay! And then the third place is like 50%, actually probably 60% kind of like home accessories, but there's a little vintage rack in there too, and it's just really cute. Fun. Cute junky store. A collage. So tell everybody you've had sifted clothing for what, three years, four years? Yeah, it's been about four years, I think, since we first started it. We've only, we all probably only sold clothing for about two and a half or three. Okay, so it started as 
vintage, yeah, just, just selling online right. mainly. Basically, yeah. And so we, we, my friend and I, Miller, she and I just sold vintage from my basement. We would freaking scour the earth. <laughs> and then we got a shop and basically had it for a year and decided to actually Never mind. This is not sustainable. My <laughs> life is falling apart. <laughs> so switching gears and going to develop a brand. Woo! I heard all about it today. I'm so excited. It'll be a very small, manageable brand, but it's going to be pretty freaking cool. When we are people going to be able to follow? Have so you used we're all launching that? our social at the top of August. So the first week of August. Oh, this video is coming out right. It will have launched. <laughs> So should we tell everybody what to? Yeah, so it'll be, I feel like, should I name it yet? I mean, Why not? So let it's everyone know. It's be called County Fair with an E, kind of like Vanity Fair. I love it. Um, it's going to be a very small line of clothing that kind of revolves around playing with juxtaposition and lots of vintage textiles that we've kind of reproduced with our own little spin. And yeah, just lots of really wearable items. I'll leave yes. it at that. Oh, you guys, Very it's, extra. I got a little bit of a behind the scenes look and I am so excited. This is maybe the coolest. <laughs> I feel like I've never seen anything like what Thank Liv you. is developing oh. and I'm so excited and I want every piece and it's oh. going to be like a small, yeah. smaller collection yeah. to start, right? Right. So basically we'll launch with, as we see it right now, four different products. Ooh! That's but, the best. Yes. And that's maybe coming officially in fall. In this fall, yeah. In the fall. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to say any date and then have to. Yes. Hold to it. Yeah. But, you know. <laughs> but you can definitely go and check out. I'll put the link down below uh, yes. for her Instagram. And I'm so excited. And I'm just so excited to be here. We have been, I don't know, Instagram friends, but yeah. more than that. Yes. For a few years now. Yes. So this was dreams coming true. We both felt like we were long lost friends that yes. just hadn't seen each other in a long time. Honestly. So much fun. Freaking stars aligning. Yes. So right now we're headed to pick up Margo and she's about to get in the car. Hey, hey, hey. Wow. <laughs> Here she comes. Miss America. America. <laughs> And Margaret? Yeah, but you can call me Margaret. It's Margo. easier. It's Yay. easier, shorter. You have a YouTube channel. Yes. Tell me all about yourself and what you do so everybody can <laughs> get to know myself. you. So my YouTube channel is currently called the Practical Magic Channel. I think I might change the name though to just yeah. my name. Yeah. Um, it's always good anyways. to have your name attached. Yeah. Yeah. And then my Instagram is at it's Margot Roth. But basically, it's kind of chaos. And <laughs> essentially, it's like if you go to either of those things to find me, you'll see like some fashion stuff, some thrifting stuff, some home stuff. I also um, own a coffee yeah, shop. I was gonna say business. I'm yeah. opening a new restaurant. Woo! She's so, a musician. Yeah, I do music. So <laughs> I, I don't know how well I do any of that stuff, but I do it all. I love that. And it's all on, so that's kind of what you'll see if you go to any of those channels and kind of watch my videos or follow me on Instagram. I'm trying to head a bit more into the home and lifestyle content because that's what I kind of enjoy the most. Mm -hmm. um, like thrifting for home decor, vintage home decor, decorating my home, and then decorating the spaces that we have our businesses in is really like my favorite thing to do. Yes. I also like thrifting clothes for myself, but probably the home stuff a little bit more so I'm gonna skew that way a tiny bit but and your home is like English country yeah cottage core picnic yeah. wealthy estate from Bridgerton <laughs> like so yeah. good wait what was I just watching oh I was watching Emma on the plane yes. and I was like the, that's the newer one yes oh my gosh I was like, this like is Margot's yeah. house inspiration that's my whole vibe. It's, it's, incredible. it's not particularly at least like I always felt super weird about it because it wasn't what was trendy I for a that. long time. I was like, I basically liked grandma stuff, but yes. that's cool now. It so is. if you're interested in that type of style, how to style your home in a kind of maximalist, but English functional, estate, yeah, countryside. English countryside, yes. very yes. European, Cotswolds, yeah, yes. very Cotswolds, English country vibe. So that's kind of my whole thing. That's what I like to yeah. do. Yeah, and you have a home tour video, right? 
Yes, although I just oh, you just moved. moved. Woo! It's so lovely fun. Just moved and bought a house, and I'm in the process of decorating it and gathering things for it. That's actually like today. I was like, what am I gonna thrift for? And I, I'm gonna try and thrift for some home stuff because I have got to just like keep going. Keep Keep yeah, going keep with the maximalism. It. Exactly. I have to get more. <laughs> more. Yeah. More is more fun. Enough. And like the house is bigger, so I have yeah. to fill it. Like you have more room, you need to get more stuff. Yeah. She goes with her Eric would look. Eric would literally kill me. He's like, we literally have so much stuff. <laughs> Should do this color, and I, I was like, she Oh, did do it because of me. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just know her twinsies with their nails. Hello, she we literally was like, lady. <laughs> we go to the same girl, and she was like, I think you'll like this one. I was like, Oh, okay, <laughs> you literally did it. That's hilarious. She's such a nut. Okay, we're Rich we're headed nut. into the Goodwill, yeah, right? First Goodwill. Oh, okay, so y'all are taking me to your one of your spots. Goodwill spot. It's a yeah. big Goodwill. It's a big boy. Yeah, it is. I'm Thanks on the hunt for some accessories. I'm in the mood for some shells, more shells in my life. Oh, yeah. Shell belts, shell necklaces, anything southern and fun, which I always love when I come to the south. Hilton head, baby. Yep. Yeah, like not sticking to your um, thigh because of your sweat in the summer, you know what I'm saying? That's a little more comfortable. <laughs> so these could, these could be a cute option. We'll see. Okay, and I found this really cute kind of choker black leather necklace. I like how, you know, tight it would be right here on the neck. I just found these Isaac Mizrahi New York little pink bow front heels that are kind of fun and playful. Oh, <laughs> Look, Liv just found these little pink Via Spiga slippers. Holy cow, these are so cute. They're my size. Uh, these might be some of the best shoes ever found thrifting. They're so cute. <gasps> Not in season, but a very cute little wool knit. I probably won't like it, but I do like it. I always love a, a ribbed product. And then I just found this green kind of sheer little wrap number. I am loving this. Yes. Oh my gosh. I love this. Of the south. So I just found this sheer, and I think it's vintage. I'm almost positive. Like sheer, kind of silkyish material with this huge kind of 70s collar, and then little buttons all the down, all the way down the front. Very cute, kind of summery. Tuck it into jeans or something. Easy wearing. Kind of a vibe. Hard to see, but it has this little floral. It's very uh, a 90s little cami with a higher neck. Pretty cute. Found this little shacket, which it could be cute or it could not work, but I just want to put it on. It's like, what is this? It looks like a tortoise shell? Yeah. Is that what it is, kind of? It's cute with what you're wearing. I think these buttons are kind of fun too. They have these little buttons. Ooh, cute. <laughs> Wait, come show. Come show what you found. So we're thinking maybe. Yeah, I know. I want to see this on. So, oh, yes. Give us the house loot. Very, oh, very large basket with a smaller basket inside as a bonus. Basket, bone basket. Then I'm really obsessed with terracotta right now. So I got these terracotta pots. 
These aren't vintage ones, you can tell, because they obviously don't have any scratches, and I like them to look a little more, more like worn in, but they're still cute. And then the best thing that I found so far <gasps> are these. Oh, no. I don't, he's a little broken. There's a set of two. Oh, who that is I don't amazing. Know what, what are they? Just like decor? Yeah, I, I think, think you hang them on the wall. The, oh, maybe you could put a Look plant in it? Flower, I but I kind of like it as is. I yeah. love them though. I'm just gonna hang them on my wall as like art. So. Perfect. Yeah, that's everything so far. I'm gonna go back over there and keep looking. And then I have this kind of little summery that's knit it. floral tank, which I think is really cute. I like how like washed out the flowers are. Very fun. What did you find? This feels like a very, it says New York 95 News. I kind love of that. I like it. Yeah. Too next, though. yeah, I know it needs to be a crew. Yeah. Yeah. I found this. I'm, it's like a maybe, but the the print is really cool. It's kind of interesting. It has this little like uh, peplum -y flare. Yeah. In the but pleats. What it was say. Yeah, I feel like so. Show the front. Okay, so there's the front. So this is a little V, but I thought that the shape would be more flattering with Backwards. the high neck, yeah, yeah, and kind of like the two points on the shoulders, basically. Yeah. So I, feel I like love this the pleat. needs to be put on in C. In C, yeah. But it's it's like a really look and see. Cool I agree. Yeah. Very cute. We found this cute little pastel bomber. Oh, that's cute. It's very cute. I like the length. Ooh. Cute, cute. Very cute. cute. This is a grandmother chic. Sweet grandmother. <laughs> Very cute. I just found this really cute pleated skirt. I like the um, pastel and kind of washed out tones of this. I found this cute baby blue midi length skirt. I like the little pockets and it's more of a pencil skirt shape but longer. So it has potential. I just found these kind of fun red heels with these bow on them. They're very primary colored and playful. I'm not sure. I want to kind of see them in a mirror, but they're very cute. All right. A bowl. Ooh, that's I feel so like pretty. a little pro tip. It's not really, I'm not a pro, but it's finding things at thrift stores that are large. Like oh. You can find lots, lots of, of small things. things. That's so true. But it's hard to find large small yes. items. Yes. What would you do with that? Probably a coffee table. It's got some gunk. I love it. You need to clean it out coffee table or shelf. It's just like sculptural. Yes. That is so true about small and large yeah. things because I've been looking for larger Large things and they're very hard they're to hard find to at thrift stores. So if you do, bring them home. Yeah, for real. And then wait, I feel like, Margo, you found something. Yes, okay, so, well, really Well, a few thing. things. These are, uh, these are like shorts. Yeah, they're not those. cute. No, but they're very cute. Yes, they are. Those, that's the maximalism yes. athleisure yes, metropolitan, yes, yeah, yeah. but yeah. summer. And then I like Ooh, this. Ooh, yes. Like cover up at the beach or yes. something. It's like linen. And yeah, I love that. Linen good. And then I found this <gasps> adorable Perfect. little. It is. It's like actually painted on there, which I. I like. anytime it was like. I don't want it to be like. Yeah, a print, anytime you know? it's hand painted. And then it's a win. I found this little top, which is a little Ooh. silk. But has How would you style that? It. Honestly, I'm kind of basic. I feel like it would look really cute with jeans. Yep. Or like I don't know, a little skirt. We're tucked in, even like, I don't know, yeah. I like, actually, like, no, that's so like cute. shorts. Yes. Like, like that. Kind of wear, like, yes, and like a bucket hat, some sandals, yeah, like your perfect little. Full outfit. So. Yes, right there. there. It's a <gasps> Ooh, wow. Another coffee table object. Another, Ooh, another okay. big one. Yeah. And then this just little like wool sweater. Perfect. But I like the length of it and I like the color and it's, it's got a few little holes. But sometimes okay. that gives a character. Yeah. Well, you found that bag? I found this. Oh, that's I so that cute. cute. <gasps> I love that color. Such a pop of fun. Fun. A pop of fun. I just found this corset. Hey, they've extended their kind of love that. I always feel that way when I bring like, people to new places. I'm like, I hope it's a good day for you. Okay, this is vintage Valentino little corset top. Remember that corset I found? I thought it was gonna end up being like Forever 21 or something like that. Nope, Valentino. Coming home, look at those ruffles. 
So cute. Tried on the blue skirt and I was thinking this was gonna be a no, but then I'm thinking it's a yes, because I think it's, I love how this color and the cut, the cute little pocket detail right here. Very fun. I think it's definitely a child hat, but I can look ahead, so it worked. Okay, I tried it on the cute little knit tank and I think I'll get this because I just think it's a good little essential and I like the print. And then this really great little gauzy number, which was so perfect with my Southern inspiration that I had with my Savannah suite. This would have been a perfect find before the trip. But I love this, and I love that it's a little wrap shirt. All right, Let everybody with their loot, their Woo haul. It was a good day at the Goodwill. Good day. Thank you. Truly. Where are we going? Where are we going, ladies? Which is, what is this place? This is Margo's Coffee Shop. designed this space, right? Yes. Yeah, it's all basically drifted or secondhand. Yeah, so give us another mini tour. <laughs> Smaller area. So cute. All the art. But again, just Oh my gosh. Even this furniture you found, all of this. Yeah, Nina Margaret found this guy. We had a blue one, but it like completely was. These, these were in sifted for a while in the basement shop. Oh, I think I remember those. So we just walked up stairs to Margot's restaurant that she's opening. Yes, so I don't have the key, so it's locked, unfortunately. I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm a fraud. It's gonna be so cute, um, though. But yeah, we're in the process of like decorating all that stuff as our table bases. So yeah, it's gonna be like a bar slash small plates. And I'm begging you to do more and desserts. What's it called? Yeah, desserts. It's gonna be called Theodore's. Theodore's? So yeah, so it's a bar, and then on this side, that's like the dining and all of that. And then on this side is going to be a market slash like a grab and go. Oh my gosh, how fun. And then you'll have tables up here too. Right? Yeah, and then this whole breezeway will have, I bought this massive chandelier that I'm gonna hang up there. And then we'll have tables and we need some like topiaries and rattan yeah. stuff. And yeah, really cute. Creative oh. women making things happen, making dreams come true. So this is sifted, but the doors are closed. Wait, what is all this, Olivia? It's some Goodwill stuff. You can go through it. Goodwill stuff? Yeah. You, uh, uh, you'd be hard pressed. I mean, there's literally like ice, uh, plastic things in there. Like it's not like it's not like great, great. Stuff. Here, come have a swing. One, oh, yeah. one swing outside sifted. Hold on, I don't want it to fall. Wow! It literally every day someone sits here. I don't know. Why? I don't want to kill everybody. You're not oh, going to. <laughs> oh my one, gosh. Any final thing. thoughts about sifted? Um, I it was a very expensive, great learning experience, <laughs> <laughs> and I love vintage forever and always will. And I'm really excited for what's next. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think sometimes you have to have dreams, try them out, learn mm -hmm. some lessons, mm -hmm. and also know when to say say goodbye. Yeah. You know? It's a good lesson in, in life. Yes. It is. I think we've revealed County Fair to you guys already. But this is the inspiration, the fun behind Liv's wow. new line that she's launching. So link below, check it out. Okay! Bye. We're all done. <laughs> Bye. We're Bye. Bye. It was such a fun day the hanging out with you guys. The best the day best. ever. We thrifted, we ate good food, we had good coffee, mm -hmm. we reminisced about 
closing the yes. doors, but reopening them to mm -hmm. more fun. So I finally just want to say, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe to my channel. I have new videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And always, always play, play dress up! up.